everybody, this is Praxis, and I'm back on site again today. I was anticipating that the plumbers were going to be here, but I, I don't see them here at the moment. Uh, it's a little bit after lunch right now, and uh, as you can see, it's, it's flurrying. There was much heavier snow earlier today. I didn't see any point in coming before lunch and trying to work up here, uh, you know, doing carpentry with it snowing and everything. So a lot less snow falling down right now. So anyway, I showed up after lunch. I was planning on them being here. I had some things to deliver to them, uh, you know, some fittings. Um, uh, that I wanted to put in, but uh, they're not here. Uh, but I figured, why don't we go in and kind of check? I've got a respirator for walking in. This has been sanitized. I've been using UV to sanitize it. I understand that UV light can slightly de uh, degradate these things, uh, but uh, you know, I don't want to piss through all of my masks, so I've been using it so I can keep reusing these guys. As I open the door, I have a sanitizing cloth. This is a Clorox cloth with some soap on it. I'm going to clean up the doorknob here. Also, any surfaces that they may have been pushing on. In fact, I see a handprint right there. This side right here. All right. And there we go. So let's go inside. We'll see what they've been working on. All right. Let's see. They've been doing a lot in here. Oh, okay. Here's, here's some stuff. So, uh... Just up here, we have the uh, drainage pipes that are coming from the upstairs bathroom. We've got the, uh, the metal hangers holding them. I asked them to keep them on this side of the... Actually, I'll just put the camera down right now. I asked them to keep them on this side of the bay because because back here, I want to do a gray water holding tank later on, so it looks like they're following my directions for that. That's good. Coming into this room here. Wow, they've been busy here. Lots of stuff done in here. Uh, my sink, they moved over there, out of their way because they've got all this stuff in here. Uh, this venting for the, the sink, and that is looking good. And, uh, okay, what else we got? Obviously a really crazy design right here. I'm seeing this for the first time myself as well. This is coming from the toilet. The reason that it's kind of doing this weird thing all around here is because uh, I need an air vent to come right through this area and they were going all around it looks like they did a really good job of that so that's looking pretty good uh, and uh, what else we got going on here toilet they're, they're getting that going down there we've got the, the cutout for the, uh, the, uh, the tub upstairs and, the, and this pipe right here this large one this is the one I'm going to be splicing into later to grab my gray water because at this point at that junction, that brings together the tub, the sink, and the washing machine. So if I grab it here, turn it back that way, I'll be able to, uh, I'll be able to be stealing all the gray water, put it in a tank there, and then flow it out through here. So that's looking pretty good. They've got the whole run. Wow, they were busy. Maybe they left because they finished. Uh, they've got the uh, uh, drain, or I'm sorry, the uh, the vent from the sink over here. Bring it over here. The sink is right over here, and here's the venting for it. Uh, it hugs uh, uh, hugs that center beam, just the way we, we talked about, and that's looking good. And uh, well, let's see if they did anything upstairs. That's good stuff. They got a lot done. Now, this is all drain side stuff. This is not any supply side stuff. You can see my bathtub. That was crazy, bringing this bathtub up. We did it together yesterday. I was in here yesterday, I was wearing the mask. We brought this up through this bay because they couldn't get it around the radius of the stairs down there. I think they might have been able to because the top is open. I think they could have tilted it and get it, got it around. But we have this bay, so they just brought it up through here and that's gonna be headed in there. Let's see, uh, anything done in here? A little bit done in here. We'll just take a quick peek at it. All right. This is what we got going on in here is uh, the venting stuff going up to the upstairs. Behind you over here, they've got uh, the, these are the vents coming from the washing machine and everything. This is going to go up there, so they're not totally done here. This is going to take a 90 degree bend and shoot over to here and join up right into here in that vent to the upstairs. I touched the wall and cleaned my hand. That's good. They've been. They've been busy, they got a lot done, and their work looks really nice. It's, it's nicely laid out, there's nice angles. Uh, 
It just, it just looks like really nice, neat, tidy work. And a lot of times you don't have to do work that's particularly tidy, like you can get some, something done and have it be messy. But I, I really appreciate it when people, even with stuff that's going to be buried in a wall, when they do nice, clean, uh, clean work. And that's what these guys have been doing. I'm very pleased with what they get going on in here. This was actually kind of an interesting thing where we had to uh, take advantage of the fact that the tub has a cutout here. Uh, to get these uh, pipes outside the wall a little bit because it was hard to get them under there with the, the sill plate down there. So uh, it was actually an idea that I had had while we were talking about it, about the difficulty of getting things up there. I said, well, wait a second, the tub's got a uh, kind of a curve to the bottom. Let's actually measure how close the tub gets to that wall. And it actually came out a fair bit here. So we were able to bring these guys out without any uh, uh, ill consequence. So this is all good. This is great. Uh, I'm going to do a little bit of work outside today on the structure. I'm not going to be working in here, uh, both for my safety and, you know, because I told them I wouldn't be in here. But uh, this is looking good. I'm very pleased with this. So uh, tomorrow, I guess, uh, well, hopefully they'll be back and maybe they'll finish up this and then start on the supply side stuff. That's it. Thanks for watching.